Alright, so take a look at this monstrosity. This thing is apparently just called Lantern Shield. And now you guys are going, But Jelly, a shield isn't a weapon, you stupid idiot. Well, no, but it has spikes, so sh shut up. Around 15th, 16th century Italy, they came up with this thing. Because, you know, that's a good idea. Just add a bunch of spikes to something. Spikes here, spikes there, spikes everywhere. This one is like a double wolf green claw thingy going on. So that's pretty dope. And this here almost looks like a scabbard for this blade, as, as if it's retractable. Why? I mean, I don't know if it really is, but if it is, then that's dumb. I mean, it's already a clumsy piece of shit. Like, why would you make the blade retractable and by that means weaker? I mean, uh, even if the blade is retracted, then it's still a clumsy piece of shit. So w what's going on here? Okay, so it's called Lantern Shield because it has a lantern right here. It has this little hinged thingy door mechanism-ish thing that you can open and then you could shine light upon your enemies or something. Also, it forces you to constantly hold your shield up straight because if you just let it hang next to your body, then the oil will drip out. And that's great. Now, apparently, these lanterns are completely closed in the back, so you won't get any oil splash in your face. It'll just drip out of the front side. It also has all kinds of holes here, like, um... Yeah, yeah, I don't, I don't really know what to say about that. I don't know what they are or what they're for. I mean, I don't know if they're anything, really. I mean, uh, there, there's so much weird stuff going on that I just don't know what to say. So it's a shield and it has an arm strap right here and, and a gauntlet uh, that you put your hand in. So not like a normal shield that is just, you know, has your hand covered by the shield. Now it's it's you, you have your hand covered by a gauntlet. So because, you know, that's... That's better to put a gauntlet there, even though you have to hold this little bar thingy right here So you still hold it the same as you would hold a shield. There's no difference there. You just Now it's now it's a gauntlet instead of a instead of a shield because uh, Gauntlets, you know, I also now see that there's some mail in the middle of the hand here um, some some mail on the inside of the gauntlet. Now that's fine. That's you know that happened can be pretty useful for for example grabbing your opponent's blade just really safely. But you're forced to hold on to this bar, so it doesn't do anything. Like, why is it there? What what does it do? I mean, what the fuck? Just the gauntlet just extending past the shield is uh, why? You know, actually maybe I got it all wrong. Maybe it's not a shield with a gauntlet attached. Maybe it's a gauntlet with a shield attached. That makes way more sense. No, it doesn't. It, make, it still makes no sense. This is what happens when you eat too much spaghetti. Alright, so that was it. I hope you enjoyed. You can click this button on the left to see the previous one. You can click the button on the right to see the next one. And stuff like that. It's pretty, it's pretty self-explanatory. You can click the round thingy here and to subscribe and, and stuff. And thank you for joining my quest and blah-de-blah-de-blah. Blah, blah. Okay. Bye.